Robert Germain Thomas, uh, a, a Welshman, and he was the first Protestant missionary to Korea. And he basically went there and taken in Bibles in the Chinese script, which the Koreans could read. And he, went, he risked decapitation if caught. Eventually he was caught and he was decapitated. And there's a lovely story told that in the 1907 revival that we're talking about, one of those who went forward and made a confession of faith in Christ actually stood up and publicly said, I was the one who executed uh, Thomas and uh, was, was his murderer. That's right. I mean, what a confession to make to say that I was the one who killed that man who tried to bring us the good news of the Lord Jesus Christ. In many respects, it could be said it was like the, like Saul when he was converted. You know, he was there consenting to the death of Stephen, the first uh, Christian martyr, but then God had mercy upon him. And Paul went on to do wonderful, great and mighty exploits for the Lord. But what is interesting, the actual executioner, like, who like I say got converted, as Robert Jermaine Thomas was fleeing ashore, he was handing out these Bibles as, as quickly as he could because he knew that once he got caught and captured, that would be it for him. But anyway, the executioner took one of those Bibles himself and he used the leaves as leaves of the Bible as decorative wallpaper and he literally plastered them around his house. So, you know, this man got the Bible, he got the word he of God. Was yes, it's incredible.